Hello. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you today? Yes. Welcome, welcome. And you? I am doing great. Very happy to see you. Very happy to be here in another opportunity of learning. This is a very nice thing. Welcome, welcome to your class. And I hope that you have had a very good day. ¿Qué tal su día? How was your day? How was your day? Ah, uh -huh. good, bad, so so, excellent, fantastic. It was good. 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 It was awesome, right? It was awesome. It was good, fantastic, right? Perfect, marvelous. You can say. There are many ways to answer the question, how was your day, right? We are going to start a little bit with that one. If I ask you, for example, how was your how day? How was your day? Mm -hmm. Let's, let's. How was, how was your day? Your day? How can you answer? How can you answer to it? Okay, creo que tengo un feedback ahí. Juanita, tenemos audífonos para ponernos. Para ponernos. Eh, yes, ahorita voy, veo eso, permítame. Okay, sí. thank you. Okay. Que si no tenemos que el si rebote. Que si no tenemos el rebote. Good. How was your day? How do you answer this? You can say, it was good. It was nice. It was fantastic. It was wonderful. It was okay, you can say. It was okay. It was marvelous. It was so, so, you can say. It was a bit difficult. It was tiring. It was tiring, you say. And it was really bad, you can say. It was really bad. Sorry. It was really bad. It was really hard. Right? Those are the options that you can have. The first ones, for example, are affirmative and they are okay. So you say like, how was your day? It was good. It was nice. It was fantastic. It was wonderful. It was okay, teacher. It was marvelous. It was so, so. Ahí vamos bajando la intensidad, right? All right, teacher, it was so, so. It Me. was, yes? Uh, what is the meaning? Marvelous. Marvelous. Maravilloso. Uh, marvelous. You. It was marvelous. These perfect days on which you have good food, very nice environment, an easy day at work. Marvelous, right? Cuando alguien llegó con un mango verde a mediodía. Here you have. Ah, you said it was marvelous, right? Okay, it was wonderful. It was a bit difficult. Mm, right, a bit difficult. It was tiring, right? Oh, it was tiring, agotador, right? It was really bad and it was really difficult, right? It was really difficult. Or you can say that it was very busy. It was very busy, teacher. It was like, uh, Cynthia says to Cynthia, okay, Wendy, mira, Wendy, Wendy, yeah, Sandrita, da, 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 da. it was very busy, right? It was very busy. 
So whenever I ask you the question, how was your day? You have all these options, right? Eh, there are more, but I will give you just this ones. So I ask you the question again. So vuelvo y les pregunto, how was your day, people? It was very busy and tired. Very busy and tiring, uh-huh. What about the rest? It was okay. It was okay. It, it, it was, was so. fantastic. It was fantastic. It was so so. Uh-huh. It was so so. It was so so. Okay. What else? It was very busy. It was nice. It was nice. It was very busy, right? Very busy. Very busy. Busy, yes. It was okay. very busy. Okay, so there you have, there you have. How can you answer to the question, how was your day? And there you have it. It was really hard. I am still on my work, says. It was tiring, says. Okay. Oh, poor Adrianita, you're sick. Okay, we understand. And Jorge says, it was really hard. I am still on my work. Hmm. I was, it was tiring, right? So this is the way you can answer. How was your day? So tomorrow you're going to say, ah, teacher, it was good. It was nice. It was entertainment. It was fantastic. And you have options, right? You have options to answer to the question, how was your day? So it is really nice that, that you collaborate with this and that you have more options, right? to answer this. We're going to start today with a little practice, okay? I need you to get your notebook. Do you have your notebook with you? Show me your notebook. Show me your notebook, your notebook, notebook, your notebook. Show me your notebook. We are going to do an activity. I need you to have your notebook and your pen or pencil. I need you to have your notebook, a pen, or a pencil because you are going to use it, okay? And we are going to do an activity. I need you to write one word, right? One word, any word in English, okay? Uh, kids, I cannot see your cameras, okay? Hay muchas cámaras que no puedo ver. No sé ustedes, o si eres solo yo las que no las puedo ver. I cannot see eh, Anita, Oscar, Carlos Ernesto, David, Eric, Juanita, Adriana, Brian, Oscar Toniel. I cannot see your cameras. So please, Lorena Araceli, Jorge Francisco. I need to see all the cameras on. Remember that it's part of the agreements, right? It is part of the agreements to have the cameras on. So. I need you to write on your notebook any word, any word. Write any word on your notebook. Cualquier palabra. Write any word, any. Cualquier palabra on your notebook. Do you have it? Yes? Okay. Uh, Sandra, what is your word? Sandra, what is your word? ¿En, ¿En qué trabajo? No, no, no. What is your word? I need you to write one word on your notebook. One word, una palabra. I need you to write one word on your notebook. Escriban una palabra. Write one word on your notebook. Any word, cualquier palabra. Okay, uh, Guadalupe, what is your word? Hand. 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 Beatriz? Diana Beatriz, what is your word? Moon, lunes. Moon, very good. Laura Lisette? Hi. Hi. Wendy Lisette? Fantastic. Tatiana? What is your word? Window. Window. Okay, Adriana says flowers. Uh, Cynthia? Paint. Paint, okay. Hey, Isela? What is your word? It's flower. Flowers, good, very good. Let me see. So, uh, Tatiana, what is your word? Tatiana, hello. 
Lorena, what is your word? Company. Company, very good. Jorge, what is your word? Jorgito? Oh, oh Jorge, you are, you are driving, sorry. Juanita, what is your word? Juanita, what word did you write? ¿Qué palabra escribió Juanita? La he perdido. Carlos Ernesto. Night. Ok, very good. David. Awesome. Ok, awesome. Eric. Work. Work and Oscar Otoniel. What is your word, Oscar? Okay, good. So you see, that's the importance of the camera, people, okay? Uh, aquí es donde vemos la importancia de tener la cámara activa todo el tiempo. Así puedo saber quiénes están activos en mi clase. So I need to see you here in class because if you don't have the camera, I don't know if you are active or not. Please help me with that. Thank you very much. So we're going to go and do the following, right? You have a word, right? You have a word in your notebook, right? You have any word in your notebook. Todos tienen una palabra en su cuaderno, right? So I need you to do the following. ¿Qué vamos a hacer? I need you to write a new word with the last letter of your word. Okay, for example, if you have cat, si su palabra era cat, what is your last letter? ¿Cuál es su última letra? ¿Cuál es la última letra de cat? T. T, T. right? Mm -hmm. So you have to write another word with T. So tomato. What is the last tomato. word? What is the last letter of tomato? Orange. Oh, right. Yeah. So you have orange. What is the last letter of orange? E, e, right? Eraser. So what is the last letter of eraser? R. Oh. So you have rabbit. And then you have to write another word and another word. You are going to have three minutes to see how many words can you write. Vamos a ver cuántas palabras pueden escribir en tres minutos. So Starting right now, go ahead. Take the last letter of your word. Con la última letra, después con la última letra, con la última letra, y con la última letra. You're going to continue writing as many as possible. Okay, there you go. I will give you the time. I will give you the time. You are going to have three minutes. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Here you have the time. On my camera. It's right here. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Escriban, a ver cuántos pueden escribir en tres minutos. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Right, 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 right. Work, 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 work. Only the ones that are driving, please don't write anything. Si va manejando, no me escriba nada. <laughs> it's too dangerous. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Right, right, right. Sigan escribiendo y con la última que les queden, vayan escribiendo la siguiente. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. You have two minutes, 21 seconds. Right here. There you go, there you go. You have one minute, 43 seconds. One minute, 30 seconds. Continue, continue, continue. Great, as many words as possible. Mm. 
Jorge, bien. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Excellent job, Jorge. Very nice example. Oh, yeah, actually. Oh, my camera always. Uh, okay, no, but the, the, the example is good. Going to ocean, nothing good. Days, silence, example, elephant, 20 year, right? Tell nice words. You still have to. With L. L. Love. Lamp, light. Learning. See, there are many with health. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hands up. Manos arriba todos. Manos arriba. Hands up, hands up, hands up. No more. No more writing. No more writing. No more writing. Hands up, hands up. Good. Count, please. How many words did you make? Count, how many did you make? ¿Cuántas lograron escribir? Count. Trece. Thirteen. Thirteen. Oscar? Twelve. Twelve. Catherine? Uh, hello, good evening. Uh, hello. Yo ayer no pude asistir a la clase. Oh, okay. yes, I remember. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, y ahorita tenía problemas de conexión. Hasta ahorita me logré conectar. No sé por qué me he agarrado. It's okay, Catherine. I'm Welcome. sorry. No, sorry. don't worry. Don't worry. Welcome. Thank It's you. a pleasure to have you here. Thank so, you. count. How many did you make? We Thank have 13, you. 14, 10. 10. Who, who has 25? Wow. Excellent. How many? How many? Quien da más? Quien da más? 25 is the top right now. Mm. 17, right? 17. So you see, whenever you tell me, teacher, I don't know how to practice. Cuando me digan, ay, que no sé cómo practicar, teacher. This is one <laughs> little example. You don't need anything. You just need a paper. And if you don't have a paper on the cell phone, Right? If you don't have the cell phone, I mean, on, in, on an audio, I don't know. But options are there for you to practice. This is a very good way to increase vocabulary. Hoy hicieron 17. Rétense mañana a ver cuánto les salen. Put the timer. Three minutes. Hasta lo puede ocupar en familia ahí for you to practice. <laughs> practice English with your family. I do it in the parties, right? En la fiesta dicen, ahí viene la teacher con otra clientes. I use, I use it. So this is a very good exercise for you to practice vocabulary. So you have 15, 17, 14, 10, 3, 7, right? But the idea is that you challenge yourself, right? If you, uh, when you try and try, right? And if it doesn't work on the first time, keep trying. Si la primera le costó, maybe the next time it's going to be easier. Maybe the next time it's going to be better. So keep trying. Every, every day I like to bring an activity on 37 words. <gasps> Adriana, wow. Do you like reading, Adriana? <laughs> si le gusta la lectura, de seguro se le va a ser mucho más fácil. So this was a good example of a practice for uh, vocabulary. You can do it. You can do this practice and it is very beneficial, right? It is very, very, very beneficial for you. So let's go back to what we were doing. Today, I sent you a practice. Hoy les envié un audio. Tuvieron la oportunidad de verlo. De ver el mensaje, right? No el audio. Yes. So it was like a little test. And I send you another practice for you to organize the days of the week and the months, right? So it is, it is always nice that you be dependent of the WhatsApp group. Please check the WhatsApp group. It is very important that you be constantly checking there, okay? And for any message... Pero come pan, me... Perdón, perdón, perdón. <laughs> It's okay, que me traiga uno, digan. <laughs> yeah, con frijoles, please. 
<laughs> so <laughs> don't worry, Wendy. It's okay. It's okay. I understand. So eh, be pendent of the WhatsApp group. Estén siempre pendientes del grupo de WhatsApp. Cualquier mensaje, cualquier cosa, aunque sea una reacción para saber que ya lo leímos. So please be pendent of that. It is always important to, to be constantly checking the things on WhatsApp. So yesterday we were working on the months and the days, right? We were working with the months and with the ordinal numbers, right? We were working with the months of the year and we were working with the ordinal numbers on which we were explaining the different birthdays that we have. We say like my birthday is on September 15th, right? My birthday is on October 30th, right? My birthday is in December, you say. So we were working on that one. So let's go to our second class of the week. Remember the agreements, right? I am going to ask uh, Sandrita to help me with the first four agreements. The first four. Read it. Read number one, two, three, and four. Um, practice your English as much as possible. Excellent. Number two. Ask for help. Help Continue. when yo misma. Yes. Uh, ask for help when needed. When needed. Very good. Mr. Can you help me with number three? Keep your cameras on all the time. <laughs> Keep your cameras on all the time. Brian Francisco, number four. <laughs> Microphone, Keep microphone off if we are not using them. Keep microphones off if we are not using it. Guadalupe, number five. Attend all your sessions on time. Very good. Reina, number six. Participate as much as possible. Very good. Isela, number seven. Keep a cooperative attitude during class. And Oscar Otoniel, number eight. Collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. Collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. Remember, right? Those agreements are very important for our everyday classes, right? So yesterday we were working on these little exercises with ordinal numbers, right? If we have, for example, these little uh, abbreviation, you have 6th, 3rd, it's June 3rd, right? 4th, uh, 14th, April 14th, right? 117th, January 17th. 11th, 23rd, November 23rd. 10th, 31st, October 31st. In this one, in this exercise, the first number is the month and the second one is the ordinal number. Okay, so we are going to do a little practice with these ones. I am going to give you more examples. Sorry that I ruined everything here. Okay, and I am going to make this one a little bit smaller. Here we go. And I am going to give you other examples. If I give you, for example, this one, what will be the answer for this one? My 12. May 12th, right? May 12th. If I give you this one. March 11th. March 11th, right? If I give you this other. May 11th. What about July. this one? July 23rd. July 23rd. July 23rd, right? July 23rd. So I need you to write the version in your notebook, okay? Remember how you write the ordinal numbers, okay? Here you have the ordinal numbers for you to keep it in mind. And I am going to give you some of them on the chat. Se lo voy a enviar aquí en el chat. And you're going to write it on your notebook, okay? Okay. 
what will be the first one that I send? Ahí les envío el primero. Escríbanlo en su cuaderno. The month and the ordinal number. En la forma escrita. How do you write it? What is that one? The first one that I sent. Okay, I sent three already. Four, and the last one. Five, okay, let him be a sink. I sent you five. And I need you to write the month and the ordinal form. And in a moment, I am going to ask you. Let me know when you finish. You are lucky because I gave you copy. The D copy, though, <laughs> because I put the picture. Okay, when you finish, raise your hand. Cuando terminen, levantan su manita. So I know that you finish. Oscar, what is the first one? August 19th. Okay, you say August. 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 19th. 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 19th, right? The TH at the end. La TH al final es el sonido de 19th. Guadalupe, number two. January 31st. January 31st. Very good. Wendy, number three. November 28th. November 28th. Very good. Catherine, number four. And that's uh, the number four. Yes. November 28th. Okay, November 28th. Isela, the next one. August 5th. August 5th. August 5th, okay? 5th. Okay, that's that's the new one. I, I didn't write it, but then it was good. August 5th, that was good, right? August 19th was the one. And let me see, am I missing someone? Let's see, let's see. Okay, I will lower the hands. Good. What was the last one? ¿Cuál era el último que les envié? It was? February 14th. February 14th. February 14th, right? Good, February 14th. The first one was August 19th, January 31st, November 28th, December 24th, and February 14th. What do we celebrate on February 14th? What do we celebrate on February 14th? San Valentin. 
Friday. Some Valentine's Day, okay? Valentine's Day. What about December 24th? Christmas. 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 What do we celebrate on Christmas. August 5th? Vacation. And the vacation. <laughs> the vacation, <laughs> right? The vacation, right? Good. What do we celebrate on January 1st? New Year's. New Year's Day. What do we celebrate on May 10th? Mother's Day. Mother Day. Mother Day. Mother's Day. Mother's what do we celebrate on October 1st? Halloween. Uh, Halloween. Halloween. October 1st. Um, no. No. <laughs> Wow. Halloween, October 1st. Children. The Children's Children. Day. Very good. The Children's <laughs> Day. Yeah. What do we celebrate on September 15th? Independence. Independence. Day. Independence. Day. No, teacher Nati's birthday. <laughs> ah. Okay. Ah. <laughs> okay. It's Independence Day. Yeah. Many people does the same, right? They are like, mm -hmm. ay, que chivo, hoy es el día de la independencia. Va. And I'm like, that's my birthday. <laughs> so it's vacation, they say. So that's it. When do we celebrate Halloween? Uh, 31. October 31st. 31st, right? October 31st. Oh, when do we celebrate Teacher's Day? John. September 19th? No. September? No. No. June. June 22nd. June 22nd, right? June 22nd, right? On Thursday. Pasado mañana. June 22nd, right? So here we go. Let's continue right here. Give me one second. Le vamos a dar libre ese día. <laughs> You know, the best way to celebrate Teacher's Day is teaching, right? That's the best way to celebrate it. ¿Cómo celebramos el Teacher's Day? <laughs> ¿Cómo celebramos Teacher's Day? Teaching. So I will have class. That class. Day. Definitely. I will have a class. So it says, happy birthday, right? We have a, a conversation here. Listen to the conversation and then we are going to practice it says are you going to do anything exciting this weekend well i'm going to celebrate my birthday fabulous when is your birthday exactly it's august 9 sunday so what are your plans well my friend kayla is going to take me out for dinner nice is she going to order a cake? Yeah. And the waiters are probably going to sing happy birthday to me. It's so embarrassing. <laughs> Have you ever gone to Pizza Hut to celebrate your birthday? Mm. Yes. <laughs> what happens when you celebrate your birthday at Pizza Hut? They are like, -da 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 -da. <laughs> you're like, <laughs> And happy birthday in front of it all. <laughs> and then you don't know what to do. It's you are just like <laughs> Yeah, veces que uno ni está cumpliendo años, pero los amigos le hacen de que la broma que está cumpliendo años. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, like, hey. So, what is your face? You don't know what to do. You don't know what face to to show. You are just like <laughs> <laughs> Con pena, pero sí. Yeah. <laughs> And then you, you feel happy birthday. And she says, it's so embarrassing. It's like, uh, because all the restaurants are like, hey, there's a birthday. Look, look. It's so embarrassing. It's like, ay, están, están, no es embarazoso. Embarazoso, mas no embarazada, right? That's different. Embarrassing is like, oh my God. Oh, you feel ashamed. You feel like, oh no, right? So, what is the form of sentence that we have here? It is future plans, plans for the near future. When you use sentences with going to, you use sentences in the future. You say, are you going to do anything exciting this weekend? Okay, esto no está pasando todavía. It's going to happen on the weekend. Are you going to do anything exciting on Saturday? Ah, 
I am going to celebrate my birthday, right? These are plans for the future. I am going to celebrate my birthday. Fabulous. When is your birthday exactly? It's August 9, Sunday. And it says, so what are your plans? My friend Kayla is going to take me out for dinner. ¿Qué significa decir, is going to take me out? La va a sacar a cenar. La va a sacar a cenar. In this case, me va a sacar a cenar, me va a llevar a cenar, right? Is she going to order a cake? Ella va a ordenar un pastel. Va a ordenar un pastel, right? Is she going to order a cake? And he says, yeah, and the waiters are probably going to sing happy birthday to me. Y los meseros tal vez me canten happy birthday. It's so embarrassing. It's like, oh, no. So going to is one of the easiest structures of English because you don't move, you don't do a lot of changes on this one. I am going to do, he is going to do, she is going to do. And it doesn't change, right? So practice with me. Are you going to do anything exciting this weekend? Are you going to do anything exciting this weekend? Are you going to do anything exciting this weekend? Are you going to do anything exciting this weekend? Are you going to do anything exciting this weekend? Exciting, exciting. Exciting. Okay. Exciting. This is a question, exciting. right? This is a question. You have to make the intonation of the question. Are you going to do anything exciting this weekend? Are you going to do anything exciting this weekend? Well, I'm going to celebrate my birthday. Well, I'm going to celebrate my birthday. Fabulous. 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 Okay. No le va a decir a alguien, mm, maravilloso. Mm. <laughs> so you say, fabulous. <laughs> You need to oh, the accent, right? Imagínese que alguien llegue y le esté contando algo súper chévere. Es like, ah, hmm. nice. <laughs> you have to feel it, right? You say, fabulous. 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 When, when is, is your birthday you exactly? Exactly. When is your birthday exactly? When is your birthday exactly? When is your birthday exactly? It's August 9, Sunday. It's August 9, Sunday. Oh, so what are your plans? 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 Well, my friend Kayla is going to take me out for dinner. Well, well, my friend, 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 my very good. Nice. Mm, yeah. Is she going to order a cake? Nice. If nice. She going to order nice. Is she going to order a cake? Yeah. And the waiters are probably going to sing happy birthday to me. Yeah. 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 And, and the, uh, in the wire are probably going to sing happy birthday to Going me. to so sing happy birthday. Embarrassing. To it's me. so yeah. embarrassing. Embarrassing. It's, so embarrassing. it's so embarrassing. Embarrassing, right? It's embarrassing. embarrassing. Waiters, the waiters. The waiters. The waiters. The waiters. Okay, yeah, and the waiters are probably going to sing happy birthday to me. It's so embarrassing. Yeah, and the waiters are probably going to sing happy birthday to me. It's so Embarrassing. Embarrassing. Good. Embarrassing. Okay. Guadalupe and Mr. Roberto. Go ahead. Guadalupe is Angie and Roberto is Philip. Are you going to do anything exciting this weekend? Well, I am going to celebrate my birthday. Fabulous. What is your birthday exactly? 
It's August night, Sunday. So what are your plans? Well, my friend Kylet is going to take me out for dinner. Nice. Is she going to order a cake? Yeah. And the waiter are probably going to sing happy birthday to me. It's so embarrassing. Embarrassing. Good job. Reactions for your friends, people. Very good job. Let me see. Where are my reactions? My reactions. Where are they? Okay. Send reactions to your friends. Very good job. I am going to send you a beautiful heart. Very good job. Mr. Oscar and Wendy, go ahead. Aren't you going to do anything exciting this weekend? Well, I'm going to celebrate my birthday. Fabulous. When is your birthday exactly? It's August 9th, Sunday. So what are you playing? Well, my friend Kayla is going to take me out for dinner. Nice. Is she going to order a cake? Yeah, and the waiters are probably going to sing happy birthday to me. It's embarrassing. Very good job. Very good job. Reactions for your friends. Nice job. Very, very nice job. Excellent. Let's go with Diana and let me see. Dianita, Beatriz, <laughs> and Jorge. Go ahead. Uh, are, are you going yeah. to do exciting this weekend? Well, I I am going to the celebrate my birthday. Fabulous. When is your birthday exactly? It's August night Sunday. So what are your plans? Well, my friend Skyla is going to take my own for dinner. Nice. Is she going to order a cake? Yeah, um, the wait are probably going to sing happy birthday to me. It's so embarrassing. Uh, embarrassing. <laughs> Very good job. Nice job. Reactions for your friends, my dear students. Reactions for your friends. Very good job, right? You did a very nice job. Stars for you. Very beautiful. So as you can see here, thank you for my volunteers. <laughs> volunteers that are, were a little bit dedocratic, right? Yeah, voluntarios un poco escogidos. <laughs> Elegidos, forzados. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> they were selected. Okay, good. So as you can see here, we have the different structures for going to. And I am going to give you some examples of the structure for going to. Here you have. Going to is very simple. The only thing that you need to be careful is the verb to be, right? The use of the verb to be that goes according to the subject, right? If you say, for example, I, you are not going to say I are. You're going to say I am. I am going to play. I am going to swim. I am going to wash. Okay, and it doesn't change, right? You don't change the verb. The verb is the same. You don't change it. And the only thing that you are going to change is the verb to be that accompanies the sentence, right? So you say, I am going to, he is going to, we are going to, okay? Tell me one thing that you are going to do after the class. I am going to sleep. what? <laughs> sleep, right? I am going to sleep. What are you going to do after class? I am going to watch TV. What are you going to do? I am. It. I am going to listen to music. I am going to listen to music. I am going to eat. <laughs> it. I'm going to take a shower. I am going to take a shower, right? I will probably take a shower. It's hot. I am going to. What are you going to after the I, 
I am going to play video game. I am going to play video games. Nice. Yes. What is she going to do after class? I have different options right here. Let me just stop sharing. Okay. Okay. What do you think? What do you think this lady is going to do after class? What is she going to do? The clean. She's going to clean, right? She's going to clean. What about him? Cook. Complete sentence. He is he going is to. He is going to cook. He is going to cook. What about her? He is going to play piano. Play piano. Play piano. Play the piano. She is going to play the piano. She is going to the piano. She is going to play the guitar. He is going to play the guitar, right? The next one. Um, they they is going to. They are. They are going, going to, to play. skate. They are going to skate, right? They are going to skate. The next one. What is she going to do? She is going, going, to, going, to, sing. going to sing. She is going to sing. What is she going to do? She is going to She's going to ride a bicycle. No, ride. She's going to ride a bicycle. A bike. A bike. A bike. She's going to ride a bike. What is he going to do? He's going to feed the cat. He's going to feed the cat. To feed the tiger because look at that. It's a very big cat. He is going to. He's going to the plant. He's going to the plants. He's going to plant the flowers. He's plant going to flowers. plant the flowers, right? He's going to flowers. plant the flower, the flowers. What is she going to do? She's going to fix. She is going to fix what? The um, television. The television. She's going to fix the television. Fix. Um, she is going to. We are. Mm, she's going to go where? Donde va ir? She's going to go. Beauty salon. To the beauty <laughs> salon, right? She's going to go to the beauty salon at midnight, right? Es que hay horario vampiro. She's going to go to the beauty salon. <laughs> what about this one? <laughs> La ronda médica. <laughs> she's going to. She's going to. The, the doctor is going hospital. to the hospital. She's going to go to the hospital. She's going to see the doctor, and the doctor is going to see the patients in the hospital. What is Teacher Nati going to do? I'm oh, no, sorry. <laughs> he is going to. Wash. He's going to wash. Wash. To wash the clothes. What wash is clothes. another form to say this? Hay otra forma para decir que va a lavar la ropa. What is it? It's with do. Va con do. He is going to do? The laundry. To do the laundry. Very good job. She's, he's going to do the laundry. What about this one? Dancing. They are going to dance. They, they are, are going dance. to dance. They are going to dance. What about this one? She is going to paint. She is going to paint. Okay, si decimos, por ejemplo, he is going to the paint, él va a ir a la pintada, o él va a ir a la pintura. He is going to paint. He is going, he is going, to, paint. going to paint. And then you have a good exercise. What about this one? Uh, He's going, He's going to act. act. He's going act. to act. What about the children? 
They are going to play. The children are going to play, okay? The children are going to play. What about this one? What sentence could you make? Ball. Uh -huh. They are going to ball, no. It is going to play. He is going to play what? Basketball. 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 Very good job. Okay, Juanita. She is going, is to, going cook. to cook. She's going to cook. <laughs> She's going to cook cookies, right? Uh, Pelusa. <laughs> it is going it's to play. Going it is going to play, to play right? Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, besito. Snake. <laughs> Snack. <laughs> Snake. It's not, it's no, snake. it's snake. It's snake. <laughs> what is it going to do? It is going to speak. It is going to speak. Hola, niños, ¿cómo están? No, come on, how is he going to speak? Let's see. What about this one? What sentence can you give me with this one? Is... Invent a sentence. Uh... I am, you are, I here. am, breakfast, breakfast, I am going to eat my breakfast, I am breakfast. going to eat my breakfast, what about this one, ¿Qué oración me pueden hacer con esto? it's an onion, I am going to buy onions, I am going to buy onions, right, I am going to buy onions, Oh. And this one said like, teacher, what is the name? What is the name of this? It's an onion, right? And the last one. The last one I am going to use. Let me see. Ooh, it flew away. And <laughs> what about this one? Chop. Give, invent a sentence with this one. It is going to swing. It is going to swim. Very good job, right? It is going to swim. Excellent sentences, the ones that you created. Very good job, right? These are my friends, the cars. So, a ver un montón este mood. So, good, very good job with the cards. Excellent. I am going to call the attendance and then we're going to continue. I need you to write on your notebook three sentences that you remember. Escriban tres oraciones en su cuaderno que recuerden de las fotos. Go ahead. Three sentences. He's going to dance. He's going to wash the clothes. Any sentence that you remember. And remember? los que tenemos mala memoria. <laughs> Invent three. <laughs> don't worry. Invent three sentences if you don't remember. But if you remember, write three from the pictures. Okay, I am going to call the. No sé si podría mostrar otra vez la imagen de los ejemplos. Ooh, I gave you a lot. No, 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 de del PDF. Ah, okay, <laughs> good. Yeah, I will. I will do it right now. Yo dije, quiere todas las fotos de nuevo. There you go. I am going to share it with you right now, for you to have the structure, right? Here you go. Okay, that's the structure. And then you can get the idea. There you go. Ana Isela. Thank you. Present. Thank you. Ana Ruth. Ana Ruth Perez. Brian Francisco. Oh, Brian was here, but. Carlos Ernesto. Present. Thank you. Cynthia Marisol. Present. David Alejandro. Here. David Rafael. Present. Diana Beatriz. Present. Diego Rodrigo. Diego Rodrigo Mendoza. Okay. Dieguito. It's not here. And let me see. I will organize my screen. Wait, give me a second. Voy a organizar aquí mi pantalla. Then let's continue here with Eric Javier. 
Present teacher. Thank you. Okay, Diego Rodrigo, no, right? Fatima Ivin, I think she wrote on the chat. Jorge Francisco. Josué Abel. Josué. Josué, where are you? Nothing. Okay. Josué Abel, ah, it's connecting with the audio. He's having issues. Okay, let's continue with Juana Margarita. Juanita. No, nah, she's there. She's like present. Thank you. Thank you. Catherine Jamilet. Present teacher. Laura Lisette. Present teacher. Lorena Araceli. Present teacher. Thank you. Mirna Yasmin. Mirna. Okay, I don't have Mirna today. Oscar Otoniel. Present. Reina. Here. Roberto. Present. Sandra. Present. Guadalupe. Present. Tatiana Vigail. Present. Úrsula Adriana. Adrianita. Ah, oh, Adrianita is connected there. Wendy Lisette. Present. Thank you very much. So I am missing one, two, three. Okay, and me. Did I uh, did I miss someone? Alguien que se me haya pasado mencionar? No. Adriana says present on the chat. Josué Abel, thank you very much. You were driving. Okay, good. Very good job. So give me your examples. Give me your examples of sentences. I need volunteers to give me the examples. Go ahead. I am going to play chess. Good. You are going to play cook. They okay. are going to eat pizza. They are going to eat pizza, okay? They are going to play cook. Okay, van a jugar a la cocina. Or they are going to cook. They are going to cook. They are going to cook, very good. If you are going to play cook, it's like vas a jugar al cocinero. I need another volunteer. Three no. sentences. And tell me. Go ahead. Uh, I am going to play video game. Yes. You are going to sleep. You are going to sleep. Uh -huh. She is going to dance. Yes. We She's... are going to breakfast. We are going to? Breakfast. El verbo. We are going to? The, fre the breakfast. Uh -huh. Pero cuál es el verbo? We are going to? Eat. 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 Very eat good. Breakfast. Right? Remember, after to, you need a verb, right? Como después de to, vamos a ocupar un verbo en infinitivo, un verbo normal. I am going to eat breakfast. Okay, Reina. Okay, they are going to skate. Okay. She is playing to the guitar. He, he is going to play the guitar. He is going to play the piano. He is going to play the piano. Very good. Do you have a small cat in your house? Reina, do you have a small cat in your house? No. No, it sounds like. Se oía como un gatito chiquitito. It sounded like that. Mr. Oscar? I'm going to teach my kid. Okay, I'm going to brush. I'm going to... Yeah, brush my teeth. I'm Good. going to drink a glass of water and then I'm going to sleep. And then I'm going to sleep. Okay, who else remembers from the pictures? I am going to the gym. I am going to go to the gym. Uh huh. It is going to sing. It is going to sing. Good. She is going to cook cooking. She is going to cook cookies, right? She's going to cook cookies. Excellent. He's going to dancing. 
he is going to dance, right? He's going to dance. Si decimos, he's going to dancing, él, es, él va a ir bailando, right? He's going to dance. After to, you use a normal verb, right? After to, you use a normal verb. So remember, right? In this structure of the sentence, you say the subject, the verb to be going to and a normal verb. If you want to make it negative, you are going to use not after the verb to be, okay? If you want to give me a negative sentence, it's going to be after the verb to be and before going to. For example, right now, I am not going to dance. I am not going to clean. I am not going to sing. I am not going to cook right now. This is to make it negative, right? He is not, they are not, or they aren't. So tomorrow we are going to study the negative sentences and we are going to study also the questions, okay? So that is going to be tomorrow. We are going to study the negative sentences and we are going to study the questions with going to, okay? We are going to study the three forms. Vamos a estudiar las tres formas. Affirmative, negative, and interrogative for tomorrow. So if you can investigate a little bit about that, that would be perfect. Si pueden investigar un poquito acerca de las tres formas, affirmative, negative, and interrogative with going to, that would be perfect. Okay? Teacher, so, yes? Can you see I am going to take my breakfast? Uh -huh. I am oh, going okay. to take my breakfast. That's correct. Me oh, voy, okay. voy a tomar mi desayuno. I am going to take my breakfast. That's a good okay. sentence. Thank you. Well, my dear class, the time really flies when I am with you. My goodness. La hora se me fue volando con usted. La pasé chévere. <laughs> it was a beautiful class. I am going to see you tomorrow. Have a good night, my dear class. Bye. I am going to. Bye. 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 Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Have a good night. Bye. Thank you. Good night. Have a beautiful night. Bye. Bye.